There are some things that are too good to keep a secret. Like how your Amex Platinum card helps you have the perfect trip. I'd like to check into the Centurion Lounge. Or how it seems like you always get those hard-to-snag tables. Ooh, yum. And how you get the most out of select can't-miss events. With access to the Centurion Lounge, Resi Priority Notified, and Amex card member benefits at select events, you'll have to share. That's the powerful backing of American Express. Terms apply. Learn more at americanexpress.com slash with Amex. Looking for some amazing TV to stream? Indulge yourself with the hits on Hulu you can't miss. Dive in with Barney, Ted, Robin, and the gang on How I Met Your Mother. All nine seasons are now streaming on Hulu. Then you can move to Modern Family, Schitt's Creek, and My Wife and Kids. We're talking every episode and every season of these shows. We're talking huge hits, streaming on Hulu whenever you're in the mood. Now we're talking. Child-proofing people's homes is hard, but Duracell is making it just a bit simpler. Not only are they committed to educating parents, caregivers, and medical professionals about the importance of battery safety, they make the only lithium coin batteries with a non-toxic bitter coating to help discourage children from swallowing them. Duracell even features child-secure packaging designed to avoid accidental opening. Learn more at Duracell.com slash power safely. Available on 2032, 2025, and 2016 sizes. At KeyBank, we know a small moment like, Huh, what's it like to have a yard? Can lead to an even bigger question like, Am I ready to buy a home? And that's the type of moment where we'll meet you. Prepared to talk about everything you need to know when applying for a mortgage. So you can try to turn those backyard dreams into reality. Paul? Yes? Question. Are you a hammock person? You know, I think I might be. For every financial need, we'll meet you in the moment. Key Bank opens doors. NMLS 399797, equal housing lender. Second date update. There's so many different themed <laughs> bars nowadays that oh, are like yeah. fun and kitschy. Yeah. Like there's one where you can get drinks on a working carnival carousel. Oh, that's Whoa. so cool. Yeah. You just go up and down on your horsey while getting schwasted. <laughs> okay. Sounds like I'm going to vomit. Yep. Yeah, yeah, that's true. <laughs> it's part of the fun. <laughs> And there's another one that's called the Ping Pong Emporium with over a hundred ping pong tables you just play and drink. The it's whole like time. beer pong wow. or whatever pong you want. Whatever type. Dude, that's awesome. Cool. My personal favorite though yeah. is Lou's gas station just off the highway. I don't think that's themed, Lose. buddy. It is themed. It's, like, it's just like a gas station. Uh-huh. And you can actually pump gas there. You just get a, <laughs> a six piece sushi and a forty of Mickey's, Ew. and then you head into the restroom. Oh. See what happens. Ew. Kitschy. That's my style. Vomiting. But I guess one of our <laughs> listeners did a themed bar for his first date the other night. Oh, no. His name is Matt, so let's talk to him. Matt, how you doing? I'm doing okay. How are you guys? Are you, are you wishing you knew about Lou sooner so you could have uh, <laughs> taken her there? I can show you where it is. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm open to new no. places. Yeah, hey, That's on. my guy. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll see you in the restroom yeah. there. But first, let's focus on this date you went on. Who is the woman that you met? Tanita is her name. Tanita. Okay. Did you guys meet online on an app? No, actually, it was a. She's a friend of a coworker of mine. Oh. Whoa! Nice. We, we never hear about things like real this. Real life people. This is weird. Yeah, I'm. I'm recently single, oh. and um, my coworker just was like, "Oh, she's recently single too." So showed me a picture. I was like, "Oh yeah, she's cute. Let's Ugh, do this." I hate that. Okay. I mean, he thought she was cute. That's exciting. Nobody he was sets you up it. unless they're taking pity on you. Aww, what? Well, they're both well, looking for a rebound, so it kind of works. I got set up right, with though. my husband. Exactly. Like, oh. yeah. Yeah, pity. Totally. No, there's yeah. no pity. Someone felt bad for you and hooked you up with some stranger. Actually, right He's a him. great man. He turned out to be the best guy ever. Yeah, he, he is. You, eh, that's, that's what I'm saying. Wait, yeah. you know, wait a you're, minute. You're the pity party wait over here. That's what I was trying to say. Anyway, this is back, mad. back to Matt Brooke. Let's not focus on your pitiful life. Matt, tell us about yours. Well, I was kind of trying to make it a year of, of yes. So okay. I can understand where you're coming from. So I just, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to say yes to these things. Yeah. Okay. Hey, why not? Uh, what was it like when you guys first met? We first, we, we talked on the phone and we decided like, yeah, let's meet in person. So we went to this bar that is like a bar and board games place. Oh, oh fuck, uh, I heard of those. Okay. Why do you say, oh, like it's negative, Jeff? Maybe board not board Jeff games Sally, but... for like, you know, romantic activity. It's I don't know fun. how that goes. But that's for fun, you, Jeff. Yes, not for everybody. like a family game night, but Depends I don't know about a date. Yeah. yeah. What, what games were you playing? So, like, my favorite game is Connect Four, and hers Fun. is Sorry. So we, we grabbed one of those, too. And those are perfect because they're easy to have conversation at the same time you're playing them. 
Yeah, I mean, that's what I like about Connect Four is like it forces you to look at the person because it's vertical, you know? Yeah, because it's vertical. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. It's vertical. Yeah. And sorry helps you apologize. It helps you practice yeah. for the that's relationship. Good. I've definitely played both of those games before, but with blindfolds and handcuffs on. So like, it was probably a little bit different rules than you played. Right. How do you know when you win Connect Four if you have a blindfold Everybody on, Jeff? Everybody wins yeah. that game. <laughs> yeah, that seems like there were some different rules. Yeah, yeah. we don't talk to Jeff about that you stuff. You did the childhood rules yeah what was it like it was great neither one of us were like overly competitive we had some drinks i mean your producer even asked me he was like is there anything that you could think of that went wrong and Uh honestly there was nothing that was weird uh we got to know each other and uh, it felt really cool do you think Hmm. it was too boring i mean like that's the only thing like if there's nothing that stood out yeah no it it was fun another thing is after the date is kind of a different story Uh oh Mm. wait what do you mean so i i fully intended to go out with her again and she was into it i we talked about it right so the next day i sent her a text and i didn't get any response so after a few hours i was feeling a little antsy so i sent another Uh and i'll just i'll read it to you guys hold on um so i wrote you better text me back because I might go out with someone else tonight. Ew. And then, like, a bunch of cute emojis. Oh, no. Uh, I mean, Ew. I see what you were trying to do there. Make- if, reading a text. If you different- spoke it, yes. maybe. But yes. reading yeah. it, especially when you read it from someone you don't know that well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Absolutely. Right. I thought she would see that it was a joke and she'd be like, yeah, what's his name? You know, like, I thought she was going to rip me back uh, on what's it. What's the yeah. name of the guy <laughs> you're going out with? Okay. So what did she say back? Anything? No, and yeah. so I just kind of sent a few more texts. No, oh, no, no, God, no. no. <laughs> what did you say as a follow-up? Uh, I just kind of stuck with the same theme. I, I just was like, "All right, I'm going out." I like oh. sent her a picture of some shoes. I was like, "See, I'm getting dolled up." No. <laughs> getting my no. pants on. <laughs> Years from now, I'm going to walk down the aisle and say I do if you don't text me back. So, bro, you tried. That is so cringy. I'm sorry. I kind of love that she ignored it all. (laughs) Have you talked to the coworker that set you guys up? Uh, no, because I just feel like it's embarrassing. It's too embarrassing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I even sent her a sorry gif with like the commercial from the board game. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Trying to make an inside yeah. joke that's yeah. not really happening there, huh? Yeah. Just too far yeah. past. Exactly. Yeah. This wow. might be too far gone, but there's a chance we could bring it back. Oh. Let's hope. Can we delete the text? Is it too late for that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It'd be too late for that, but oh. hopefully we can get her on the phone and sweetly convince her to give it another try yeah yeah i mean i really screwed up i mean you guys know that so yeah. if you can help me i'd appreciate it just don't start the convo with you better text me back yeah, yeah. <laughs> well you better okay. stay on hold this That's entire right. time we or we're go. gonna move on to a different person and get them a second date oh. update yeah For i just now. sent you a picture of my shoes <laughs> <laughs> i deserve that i deserve that yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna do your second date update right after this hold on man second date update If you're just joining us, we're on the phone with Matt, who says he went out on the perfect first date. Oh, okay. Beers, board games. Yeah, it's fun. Body flirtations. That (laughs) night was flawless. Uh Uh-huh. After the date, though, a little bit of a different story. Yikes. Matt admits he may have messed up because she wasn't responding to his texts. Yeah. And in a misguided effort to get Tanita to respond... He tried to egg her on a little bit with something like, hey, if you don't respond to me, I'm going to go out with someone else. Oh, my God. <laughs> and he'd only given it a couple hours, too, for her to respond. Yeah. It's not like she'd like left him on red for a day or two. And when he still got no reply back, yeah, he kept, kept teasing mm-hmm. for a while, saying, I'm serious. I'm going <laughs> to swipe on someone else soon. It's now like- <laughs> I'm putting on my shoes if you don't call me back. Are you a dad? <laughs> because dads never know when the joke's over either. <laughs> I am not a dad. Okay. But... okay. Just checking. <laughs> the thing is, he hasn't said, like, he's in love with her no, or anything no, like no. that. But you can tell that he does like her. And you might do some questionable things when you're really into someone. No, I, I really, truly think you read it as a joke. I think she did not. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, that's the basis of it. I think I just figured I'm already embarrassed. I might as well lean in. Yeah. yeah. You tried. 
Mm-hmm. We're going to try yeah. harder, though. We're going to yeah. try harder. We're going to call Tanita here in just a second. Digging out of a hole. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> you, you're, you're not painting it very yeah. nicely for him. You're kind of piling <laughs> well, on. You Brooke. asked. <laughs> I'm just saying, I like to get a little positivity before we oh. make these calls. A little forward momentum. Oh, okay. Then maybe she blocked you before she saw the rest of them. Oh, there we that's go. That's positive. That's good. Oh. That's yeah. the forward, bright thinking <laughs> that you. we need. Don't you feel a little bit better now, Matt? There oh, we go. Yeah. Thrilled, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Good news is we're not blocked yet, uh-huh. so let's not call her and see what she has to say. Here we go. <laughs> Hello. Hey, is this Tanita? This is. Hey, Tanita. Hello. You're on the radio right now with a fun morning show called Brooke yes. and Jeffrey. Welcome to the show, Tanita. Yeah. Oh, let me get another cup of coffee. Okay. Oh. <laughs> That's actually our tagline. Yeah. <laughs> it's N- not. Not I'm, really, I'm though. joking. But uh, <laughs> I know this might be weird, but we do want to talk to you about your dating life a little bit if you have a second. Oh, um, what do you mean? What are you talking about? Um, it's a segment that we do on our show called Second Date Update. And one yeah. of our listeners has reached out because he went out with you recently, had a great time, and now hasn't been able to arrange that second meetup. His name is ah. M- Matt. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, he said yeah. you guys played board games together, which sounded really fun. Yeah, it was fun the whole date was fun until until after the date (laughs) after the date wasn't fun well yeah i mean i don't know i don't know if he told you anything or whatever but i did hear that there were some texts exchanged and and by exchanged i mean just from him (laughs) yeah and and the good news he's self-aware at how embarrassing those are oh really well there were a lot more than just some texts it was like, I mean, I don't know to the extent of what he said, but like. He said there was a lot that he was trying to like egg you on and say he was going to go on a date with somebody else if he didn't reply. He was trying to joke. Yeah. And, but we also understand how it could be read not as a joke yeah. at all. And by like <laughs> read literally just as a red flag. Yeah, well, he like literally walked me through an entire date with somebody. And that's what? where I kind of was like, maybe. Yeah. yeah what do you mean? Uh, wait, what do you mean he walked well, you through a date? Oh, yeah. It was first like he was talking about like let's meet up and then he's like oh I'm gonna go out with somebody if you don't text me back and yeah. then it yeah. was like I'm out with the girl now what? you're missing out wait wait he really went out on dates no I think it was a joke I think he was just yeah. joking well, I thought that was that was that was the perspective that we got hold on you read us the text and maybe we can decide yeah okay okay hold on one second I'm gonna look it up you didn't really go on dates I didn't think so. <laughs> Okay, I'm walking out the door now. That was the last one. Okay. Oh, I that was just the text. A, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I just bought us drinks. Everything's going well. Oh, my oh, God. No. I think he's trying to be funny, Tanita. This, this feels icky now, though. Yeah, I'll read you his next text. Okay. 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 I'm playing pinball with her, but sure wish I was playing games with you. <laughs> uh, Wait, the board games that you were playing on your date? Uh, oh, the game. Get Get Wait, there's more? there's more? No. There's more. Oh, oh, I like that you can find the humor in this, though. I appreciate that. It's a little bit terrifying, actually. But um, <laughs> his next text, this mm-hmm. is the last one I got. So I kissed her at the end of the night, but what? was thinking of you the whole time. Smiley face, winky face, heart. Oh, oh, heart? oh no. my God. No. no. That's that's like mean. And this is o- no. This Not is over all. like a what three hour time span that he's sending you these. Well, it was like a whole day from the beginning <gasps> of. Oh my god! Did how you- how did you not respond no. or block well, him? Honestly, after the first one, I was at work. It was like there wasn't even enough time between the text oh. for me to answer him, and then it just t- went off the rails. Whoa! <laughs> um, did he make up though that date? Yeah, he too? had to. Or have. is that a real thing? I mean, what is he doing? To. Like literally texting at the same time he's kissing someone? <laughs> I'm- no, after. I'm very curious, and I just want to ask him directly because oh. I need to tell you, Tanita, that Matt's on the other line right oh. now listening oh, to this. Oh, gosh. Yeah. yeah. Hey. With another girl. It doesn't help. <laughs> Matt? Hey, yeah. Uh, I, man, I thought I was embarrassed before. Um, <laughs> Matt. Fill us Matt, in, buddy. Yeah. What, what's going on? Fill her in. I mean, what do you want me to say? I told you guys I sent some embarrassing texts already. Well, no, yeah, right, but you, didn't you said us. you sent like four. 
Not a whole day's worth. Not I just made out with my date. Yeah. Here's I don't question. remember giving Matt, a number. I were mean, you I just, on a date? What? Were, were you on a date with another woman for real? Or was that all just like made up as yeah. a joke? I really don't want to have to say. Oh, no! Dude. dude. What? Well, then it's not funny oh. at all. <laughs> I thought that you were like, ha-ha guy. No, look, look. Okay, here's it. I... So I went on another date, okay? Yes. Oh, oh my but, God. Tanita, I thought about you the whole time. No. It doesn't matter. Okay, well, maybe that's... Have you learned nothing in the last two minutes? <laughs> to be like, honey, I cheated Hard on you, but I was thinking about you the whole time. Okay. So creepy. I'm sorry. I mean, T- Tanita, does it change your mind a little bit that he actually followed through and went out with a real girl? It's like kind of sweet and truthful in that way. Mm-hmm. It'd be kind of deranged if he made that whole thing up. Yeah. I don't Honestly, think so. if he made it up, I would have gone out with him again because that was oh, like... Yeah. Kick- I totally would have because oh, he's, totally. he's really, really trying hard and maybe making a joke. But no, this is like a hard pass, hard pass. Oh, oh my God. Man. We haven't even gotten to that part yet, hey, Tanita. Uh, okay. Hey, can, can I change my answer? I, I made the whole thing up. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's rewind the tape and delete. I feel, like, I feel like this is the first time ever. It's like normally people want what they can't have and yeah. Tanita just doesn't want it. Just doesn't yeah, want it at all. At all. <laughs> but we don't know that for sure yet. Uh, I think that's pretty think clear, Jeff. But go ahead. I, I mean, it's part of the segment. I just segment. think before I ask, Tanita, yeah. obviously he's very embarrassed by what happened, but he knows he made a mistake. And sometimes when you really, really are into someone, you do really, really dumb stuff because you're True. afraid of losing yeah, them. Yeah, like make out with other women. Yes. I mean, that yeah. happens text when you're really doing into someone. Yeah, text while doing it, huh? Plus, Matt, you're yeah. not still seeing that girl, right? No, no. I mean, good answer. Okay. <laughs> I think so, he was just about to say here. Yeah. Yeah. Let's, let's, stop, Friday, let's so. stop having you let's talk and start yeah. asking Tanita if you'd like to go out with Matt one more time, oh. and we'd pay for it. You know, he was so good at Connect Four and so good at Sorry. He wins all the games, so he's really good at playing games. I'm gonna say no. Ooh. Oh, oh. That that was like a weird a way to get there. Yeah. 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 Was, yeah. Got my hopes up for a <laughs> yeah. second. I know. I feel like he's good at the dating. <laughs> I thought she was gonna. Sh- <laughs> be like, what are you doing? All right, Matt. Well, dude, there's your answer. Uh, yeah. yeah, we we can't get you another date, buddy. Yeah. I thought of something to say, but I almost feel like it's worse than the other stuff I oh, said. Oh, I don't think no. that you, you, the yeah. hole can't get deeper at this point, Matt. Go ahead. Yeah, well, go ahead. Tanita, I, I just wish you would quit playing games with my heart. No. Oh, what? oh my God. Oh. <laughs> okay. Hang up. Oh. Like, Hang up. Okay. Okay. So depressed. I was cringing as I said it, but I had to. <laughs> yeah, so we're all of our listeners. So thank you for that, Matt. Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. Oh, man, I was so hoping when we asked the question, mm. tell me that wasn't a real date. I really wanted him to say, no, that's not real. Are you crazy? Mm. I made that up to get under her skin. Yeah, that's exactly what he should have said, even if it was a lie. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> this man, I swear. And, like, that he didn't fill us in on that part, like, when we first talked to him. Yeah. yeah. We this is, like, like, important information. Very. So when he told us he really did go out with someone else, you could hear all of our reactions. Yeah. yeah. Plus, the text board was lighting up with people. Just call him an idiot. Yeah, not yeah. happy. <laughs> no. They said ditch this guy. We did get one text in support of Matt, though. Was okay. it the person, other person he was out with? No, it turns out it was from Matt himself. Oh, okay. He said, hey, this is Matt. I'm listening to myself on the radio, and I think she should reconsider. <laughs> yeah. It's not as bad as it sounds. Come on, Matt. He's really good at texting while yeah. he does things. Matt, it oh, was yeah. as bad as it sounds. <laughs> but it's amazing. He can get a lot of first dates. Yeah. I mean, he had two <laughs> back to back. Yeah. He's likable. The yeah. trick is that next one. Yeah. yeah. We'll keep working part. on that for yeah. you. But if you want some help getting another date, we can try. Just yeah, email the show. Sure. We'll call that person who isn't calling you back. Looking for some amazing TV to stream? Indulge yourself with the hits on Hulu you can't miss. Dive in with Barney, Ted, Robin, and the gang on How I Met Your Mother. All nine seasons are now streaming on Hulu. Then you can move to Modern Family, Schitt's Creek, and My Wife and Kids. We're talking every episode and every season of these shows. We're talking huge hits, streaming on Hulu whenever you're in the mood. Now we're talking. Child-proofing people's homes is hard, but Duracell is making it just a bit simpler. Not only are they committed to educating parents, caregivers, and medical professionals about the importance of battery safety, they make the only lithium coin batteries with a non-toxic bitter coating to help discourage children from swallowing them. Duracell even features child-secure packaging designed to avoid accidental opening. Learn more at Duracell.com slash power safely. 
Available on 2032, 2025, and 2016 sizes. Am I doing the right thing with my finances? Am I saving enough? Can I buy a house? Am I paying too much in taxes? Will I be able to retire? Putting a financial plan together feels impossible. What if I told you there was another way? Take FACET's free financial wellness quiz to get your score and a snapshot of your current financial health. Visit FACET.com now and discover your financial wellness score today. That's F-A-C-E-T.com. This ad is sponsored by FACET. FACET Wealth Incorporated is an SEC-registered investment advisor. This is not an offer to buy or sell securities, nor is it investment, legal, or tax advice. Hey guys, back at the playground again, huh? Yep. You know what this playground could use? A wine country. Heck yeah, and some waves. So we could go surfing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> ah, love that. A redwood forest would be cool. I'm in. Ah, ski slopes. Let's do it. Um, can a girl go shopping? Yeah, baby. Wait. Did we just invent California? Discover why California is the ultimate playground at visitcalifornia.com.